Hello everybody! Welcome back to another unique rare weapon guide here on Fallout 4. So this one is going to be how to get the spray and pray. Um, now I was at Bunker Hill and this was kind of sprung upon me. I turned around and uh, as you can see I looked at the bottom of the hill and uh, saw these guys passing, these traders. So uh, this is where Bunker Hill is anyway. Um, there and uh, it's right near the, uh, the Monument Plaza or whatever it's called. Um, that is the location, but I ran down the hill and decided to uh, just check out what this person had um, and it actually turned out to be a good choice because I bought one of my favourite weapons so far in the game. Uh, I've tried this out, it really is brilliant. Uh, and it's called the Spray and Pray. So let's go down and have a look what she's got. There you go, and you can see it has a star on it which means it's a unique rare weapon. Um, but yeah, bullets explode on impact doing 15 points area damage uh, area effect damage but uh, yeah that is it and uh, it's a it uses 0.45 rounds um, it's quite a fast fire rate good range on it uh, accuracy all that the accuracy does not matter honestly uh, I didn't think much of this when I bought it but I bought it anyway and decided to give it a try out and my god it's a hip fire machine I absolutely love it um, like it said as well they had a good area effect damage um, on it as well so literally you can just go up to people you do not have to be accurate at all you can just go up and just start spraying the bullets everywhere and it really does do some serious uh, damage actually I think I took it to a, a raider or two down here there wasn't much in this area but uh, yeah I was really really happy that I bought it so I cannot guarantee that you guys will be able to find this very easily uh, I don't know how far this uh, certain trader actually travels where they travel but as you can see, the splash fire damage on that is absolutely awesome. Um, so I saw there was a Maya Lurk over here. Now Maya Lurks can be a bit tricky really to take down. And as you can see, look, you know, that wasn't even very accurate. And it just ripped through it. Absolutely ripped through it. Um, so yeah, I'm really interested to go see what this is like against some of the, uh, the bigger bosses and things like that. I do not want to shoot her, so let's come out of that's on that one. But uh, I think there was another raid around here as well and he got absolutely destroyed. But guys, like I said, I do not know exact location, but if you come down to Bunker Hill and just hang around here for long enough, hopefully them traders will come past and you will be able to get yourselves one of them because it is a very good weapon. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, really hope you've enjoyed this and uh, I'll see you guys in another episode.